Hey there, my name is Cam. I am a junior in the College of Agriculture and Life Sciences studying animal science with a concentration in pre-professional sciences or a pre-vet track. Um, when I'm not in the classroom, I love to rock climb, I work at a local horse barn, and I also love to ski and hike, which is why I'm super stoked to be able to bring you on a little hiking adventure today um, with a bunch of my friends uh, who you'll meet in a couple of minutes. Today it's supposed to be a gorgeous day, it's supposed to be 68 and sunny with just a couple of clouds. We're going to be heading up to Jay Peak, which is about an hour and 15 minutes away from here. Um, and it's one of the most popular ski mountains for our students. It's right up by the Canadian border. And it's so nice being able to go to UVM and have the Green Mountains just like right in your backyard. They're super accessible. There's hiking for all levels. When I came to UVM, I was a very novice hiker, had only done virtually like uh, nature walks. And so coming here and being surrounded by so many students that are super into doing like some legit hiking and some backpacking, I was super inspired to really get into it. I started going out with the outing club and that's how I got hooked. I got myself a great pair of hiking boots and a beautiful backpack and I go almost every single weekend with my friends now. So I've had a lot of fun with it. Super excited to show you what it's all about. So I just finished breakfast and for that I had two eggs and some spinach and for along the way I made myself some chopped up peppers, a peanut butter and jelly sandwich for lunch, which I think will actually be really squished by the time I get around to eating it, and some wedges of Cabot cheese. UVM is closely affiliated with Cabot because they work with our dairy to turn the milk from the UVM cream program into cheese. So I always support Cabot and Cabot cheese because it's delicious and I'm super excited to eat it later. I'm heading out the door right now to go pick up my friends. They do rebuilds, whatever you need. They're open Monday through Friday. I am at the gas station right now filling up my tank so we can make it all the way there. It is an hour and 15 minute drive from here. However, this is one of the farther distances that we have to go in order to find hiking. There's hiking opportunities um, as close as 20 and 30 minutes away from the school and then more like nature walky um, kind of flatter options as close as a 10 minute walk from the school just in Centennial Woods. Hey Gwen! Hi! Hello, Hello Risa! Hello! Hey Hannah! Hello, <laughs> Hello Ellie! Hey! Could you like, could you walk on that rock if you were in the store? We are ready to go! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so some introductions. I'm gonna pass this back. There you go. I'm Ellie, I'm a senior animal science major. <laughs> I'm Risa, I'm a junior, and I'm a business major. I'm Gwen, I'm a junior, and I'm a nursing major. I'm Hannah, I'm a senior, I'm a history major. This is going to be a 5.1 mile hike round trip. <laughs> <laughs> there is a trail that runs from the bottom of Vermont all the way up to the Canadian border. And the hike that we're doing today goes right along that path and you can stop and hop on the long trail at any point throughout the state of Vermont and get little mini hikes out of it. So at this point I know that I've hiked a bunch of separate like little sections of this trail and this is just one of them. We are one mile in and we have about four more to go. I just Wait this is so out. sick. Oh my god, we should stay on this. Hello! 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 Right now we're coming down the Vermont Trail that goes, uh, comes straight from the peak of Jay Peak, so we're almost there. But as you can see, it's a big wide area. Normally the skiers flying through here, but we're walking up. <laughs> <laughs> this right here is why I love Vermont. Oh wow. That's pretty. I really it's liked lunchtime. I Joe's when I went, but... <laughs> Down that hill. Okay. It's really cool how here at UVM all of our ski mountains also double as our hiking mountains and vice versa so you know it's really nice we're able to enjoy um, these beautiful mountains in during more than one season here at UVM. <laughs> all right we're gonna start heading back down now. <laughs> <laughs> 
hiking here at UVM also doesn't stop during the summer. Um, there's a lot of options to do winter hiking, which is a totally other game, but it's just as fun and it's also just as beautiful with all the snow up here. Right, Hannah? Yeah. <laughs> so what hike do we want to do next? Maybe on Tuesday? Oh, I think I'm free Tuesday. We did it! I, I don't usually, but I'm boy, oh boy, I'm kidding. Hi, I'm Gwen. Um, so my favorite hike was actually this one that we just did. The view was rad and it was some great company and super fun to go out today. Hannah, you want to go? Hi, I'm Hannah. My favorite hike in Vermont is probably Stowe Pinnacle because there's two dogs at the top. Hi guys, my name is Risa. Um, my favorite hike was probably Mount Abe, which I did the other week. Um, the view was just amazing and it was a lot of like on your hands, rock climbing, and it was really, really fun. Hi, it's Ellie. My favorite hike in Vermont, it was probably Mount Hunger. Hi, my name is Cam. My favorite hike in Vermont was the highest peak in Vermont, which is Mount Mansfield, the chin section of it. Yeah! yeah! <laughs> so I just got home. Thank you so much for coming with me on that little hiking adventure today. Hope you got to enjoy meeting some of my friends. One of the best things about Burlington um, is that it has such access to the Green Mountains and you're able to find anyone and be able to find a hike that is right for them even if it is just 10 minutes off campus on a little walking nature trail all the way up to hiking Mount Mansfield which is my favorite hike. Um, and any of the lengths in between. You're able to find hikes that are a mile round trip or two miles round trip all the way up to 16, 17 or overnight backpacking trips if that's what you're looking for. You have access to individual mountains down to um, different uh, sanctuaries and uh, down to lakes. There's ponds. You can find anything you want here. So as I said, thank you so much for coming along with me. Hope you got to enjoy. Uh, feel free to reach out with any questions.